Life is a journey filled with ups and downs, where finding motivation and inspiration becomes essential. For those who have faith in Jesus Christ and God, this quest is deeply rooted in their spiritual beliefs. Together, motivated by faith in Jesus and God, these forces create a fulfilling life, guiding us through life's twists and turns, leading us towards self-discovery and growth. In the video ahead, we'll explore how faith-based motivation and inspiration can be cultivated, from discovering purpose to nurturing resilience. Join us on this faith-filled journey, as we unlock the secrets to a life filled with motivation and inspiration, all under the loving guidance of Jesus and God. With faith as our compass, we embark on a transformative quest, making dreams a reality under their loving care. But the Lord said to Samuel, Do not consider his appearance or his height, for I have rejected him. The Lord does not look at the things people look at. People look at the outward appearance, but the Lord looks at the heart. 1 Samuel 16 verse 7 Be still, and know that I am God. I will be exalted among the nations. I will be exalted in the earth. Psalm 46 verse 10 The unfolding of your words gives light. It gives understanding to the simple. Psalm 119 verse 130 Search me, God, and know my heart. Test me and know my anxious thoughts. Psalm 139 verse 23 Do not conform to the pattern of this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind. Then you will be able to test and approve what God's will is his good, pleasing and perfect will. Romans 12 verse 2 Finally, brothers and sisters, whatever is true, whatever is noble, whatever is right, whatever is pure, whatever is lovely, whatever is admirable, if anything is excellent or praiseworthy, think about such things. Philippians 4 verse 8 The heart is deceitful above all things and beyond cure. Who can understand it? Jeremiah 17 verse 9 But I tell you that anyone who looks at a woman lustfully has already committed adultery with her in his heart. Matthew 5 verse 28 For where your treasure is, there your heart will be also. Matthew 6 verse 21 Set your minds on things above, not on earthly things. Colossians 3 verse 2 And we take captive every thought to make it obedient to Christ. 2 Corinthians 10 verse 5 Let your eyes look straight ahead. Fix your gaze directly before you. Proverbs 4 verse 25 In all your ways submit to him, and he will make your paths straight. Proverbs 3 verse 6 The mind governed by the flesh is death, but the mind governed by the Spirit is life and peace. Romans 8 verse 6 Trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways submit to Him, and He will make your paths straight. Proverbs 3 verses 5 to 6 Keep this book of the law always on your lips. Meditate on it day and night, so that you may be careful to do everything written in it. Then you will be prosperous and successful. Joshua 1 verse 8 My soul finds rest in God alone. My salvation comes from Him. Psalm 62 verse 1 I have hidden your word in my heart that I might not sin against you. Psalm 119 verse 11 The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. He restores my soul. 
Psalm 23 verses 1 to 3. You keep him in perfect peace whose mind is stayed on you because he trusts in you. Isaiah 26 verse 3. But I say, walk by the Spirit, and you will not gratify the desires of the flesh. Galatians 5 verse 16. Whatever is true, whatever is honorable, whatever is just, whatever is pure, whatever is lovely, whatever is commendable, if there is any excellence, if there is anything worthy of praise, think about these things. Philippians 4 verse 8. But the wisdom from above is first pure, then peaceable, gentle, open to reason, full of mercy and good fruits, impartial and sincere. James 3 verse 17. Do not be anxious about anything, but in everything by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving let your requests be made known to God. Philippians 4 verse 6 For God gave us a spirit not of fear but of power and love and self-control. 2 Timothy 1 verse 7 The fear of man lays a snare, but whoever trusts in the Lord is safe. Proverbs 29 verse 25 And the peace of God, which surpasses all understanding, will guard your hearts and your minds in Christ Jesus. Philippians 4 verse 7 But be doers of the word, and not hearers only, deceiving yourselves. James 1 verse 22 Blessed is the man who remains steadfast under trial, for when he has stood the test he will receive the crown of life, which God has promised to those who love him. James 1 verse 12 I will instruct you and teach you in the way you should go. I will counsel you with my eye upon you. Psalm 32 verse 8 and let the peace of Christ rule in your hearts, to which indeed you were called in one body. And be thankful. Colossians 3 verse 15 I can do all things through him who strengthens me. Philippians 4 verse 13 But seek first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these things will be added to you. Matthew 6 verse 33 The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the stronghold of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? Psalm 27 verse 1 For to set the mind on the flesh is death, but to set the mind on the spirit is life and peace. Romans 8 verse 6 Create in me a clean heart, O God, and renew a right spirit within me. Psalm 51 verse 10 You will keep in perfect peace those whose minds are steadfast because they trust in you. Isaiah 26 verse 3 Do not be conformed to this world, but be transformed by the renewal of your mind, that by testing you may discern what is the will of God, what is good and acceptable and perfect. Romans 12 verse 2 The unfolding of your words gives light. It imparts understanding to the simple. Psalm 119 verse 130 But the Lord said to Samuel, do not look on his appearance, or on the height of his stature, because I have rejected him. For the Lord sees not as man sees, man looks on the outward appearance, but the Lord looks on the heart. 1 Samuel 16 verse 7 For the mind that is set on the flesh is hostile to God, for it does not submit to God's law, indeed, it cannot. Romans 8 verse 7 
The Lord is near to all who call on him, to all who call on him in truth. Psalm 145 verse 18 Trust in the Lord with all your heart, and do not lean on your own understanding. Proverbs 3 verse 5 For the eyes of the Lord run to and fro throughout the whole earth, to give strong support to those whose heart is blameless toward him. 2 Chronicles 16 verse 9 Commit your work to the Lord, and your plans will be established. Proverbs 16 verse 3 Keep your heart with all vigilance, for from it flow the springs of life. Proverbs 4 verse 23 for I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans for welfare and not for evil, to give you a future and a hope. Jeremiah 29 verse 11 A tranquil heart gives life to the flesh, but envy makes the bones rot. Proverbs 14 verse 30 Therefore, preparing your minds for action, and being sober-minded, set your hope fully on the grace that will be brought to you at the revelation of Jesus Christ. 1 Peter 1 verse 13 Set your minds on things that are above, not on things that are on earth. Colossians 3 verse 2 for the weapons of our warfare are not of the flesh, but have divine power to destroy strongholds. 2 Corinthians 10 verse 4 The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom, and the knowledge of the Holy One is insight. Proverbs 9 verse 10 I appeal to you therefore, brothers, by the mercies of God, to present your bodies as a living sacrifice, holy and acceptable to God, which is your spiritual worship. Romans 12 verse 1 You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your might. Deuteronomy 6 verse 5 And he said to him, you shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, and with all your soul, and with all your mind. Matthew 22 verse 37 And it is my prayer that your love may abound more and more, with knowledge and all discernment. Philippians 1 verse 9 But the fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness. Galatians 5 verse 22 The heart of man plans his way, but the Lord establishes his steps. Proverbs 16 verse 9 I will give them a heart to know that I am the Lord, and they shall be my people, and I will be their God for they shall return to me with their whole heart. Jeremiah 24 verse 7 The Lord your God is in your midst, a mighty one who will save. He will rejoice over you with gladness. He will quiet you by his love. He will exult over you with loud singing. Zephaniah 3 verse 17 but if anyone has the world's goods and sees his brother in need, yet closes his heart against him, how does God's love abide in him? 1 John 3 verse 17 For all that is in the world the desires of the flesh, and the desires of the eyes and pride of life is not from the Father but is from the world. 1 John 2 verse 16 let the word of Christ dwell in you richly, teaching and admonishing one another in all wisdom, singing psalms and hymns and spiritual songs, with thankfulness in your hearts to God. Colossians 3 verse 16 But the Helper, the Holy Spirit, whom the Father will send in my name, 
He will teach you all things and bring to your remembrance all that I have said to you. John 14 verse 26 My son, do not forget my teaching, but let your heart keep my commandments. Proverbs 3 verse 1 Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God, the Lord is one. Love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your strength. Deuteronomy 6 verses 4 to 5 So whether you eat or drink or whatever you do, do all to the glory of God. 1 Corinthians 10 verse 31 So teach us to number our days that we may get a heart of wisdom. Psalm 90 verse 12 Trust in the Lord with all your heart and do not lean on your own understanding. Proverbs 3 verse 5 So teach us to number our days that we may get a heart of wisdom. Psalm 90 